Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? If you like Amiibos, boy, I got a good little video for us today. So, uh, we're not actually doing nothing yet, but there's big stakes involved. Big stakes, I tell ya. The winner of this little tournament, of this level one Amiibo tournament, I will turn into a raid boss. So, we'll do this video. Then whoever wins, in its own separate video, I will do a complete breakdown of training, and I'll show you everything that I do, and then that should be fun. Alright, so we are kind of getting two for one videos out of this. I mean, the second video will come out later, but you'll see, it should be good. So here are the eight participants, Cloud Bowser Jr., Captain Falcon, Dr. Mario, Pokemon Trainer, Yoshi, Bayonetta, Zero Suit, Samus. And don't worry, they're raid bosses. I will give them proper nicknames. Yoshi kind of already has his, because he's a Boshi from Super Mario RPG, right? That was the game? I think so. It's been a while. Anyway, let me just randomly hit shuffle, and there's the matches. Let's see what happens. Mario, why are you even on screen? The doctor version of you is in the house. He's making the house calls today. There he is. He's facing Captain Falcon, but before we get there... Thank you, announcer. Round 1, Junior, taking on Charizard. So, to spice this up a tiny bit... No, we're not skipping. We're watching. To spice this up a tiny bit, if you've ever sat through a level 1 amiibo tournament, just let it play out. It gets boring. So there you see it down at the bottom. They are both, everybody in every match will start with 50%. Should be good. So let's do this. Who wants to be a future Ray Boss? And please stop meeting in the middle and like touching tongues. It's, it's kind of gross. They're amiibos. Bowser Jr. and the Charizard. What kind of baby would that even make? I'm kind of... Oof, I don't know if I want to picture that. Now, I believe both of these amiibos could actually turn into some pretty interesting raid bosses, if I do say so. First of all, you got Bowser Jr. You could have a lot of fun with the special moves. Explosions, just doing a lot of shenanigans. I got some ideas on how I could turn him into a raid boss. Maybe even we mix it up and we go with one of the Koopalings as the, uh... Well, there you go. Pazza Jr. is going to have a chance, but, uh... I guess I'm not going to talk about Pokemon Trainer. And let's do it. The Doc is in the house. He's prescribing some pain. Man, I gotta... I don't know... I don't have any nicknames for these two, but, uh... Something will come to me. Something will come to me. We got time. We got plenty of time. In the meantime... Fight! And when I say fight... Go kick each other's butts. Come on, you got you got to do something. You got to do something. No, no, don't just walk. No, there you go. There's an attack. That's what we need more of, right? And by the way, anybody that levels up in these tournaments, don't worry. It, it does not matter. It does not matter. It's, it, it's just going to happen. I can't really turn off leveling because it's not a thing, okay? But let's, uh, I think both of these characters could have uh, pretty unique. I mean, look, Dr. Mario, the Mario amiibo. Pretty solid amiibo. Pretty solid in terms of uh, competition and uh, how uh, how their play style works. So simple stuff. But Captain Falcon, on the other hand, that Falcon punch could be pretty deadly. Put into the right hands. <laughs> I have no idea on how to make it better, but I'll come up with something if he wins. Well, looks like I don't have to worry about coming up with a Captain Falcon gimmick. Next up, Zero Suit Sam is taking on the Final Fantasy Remake or Cloud. That would be a terrible... No, I'm definitely not naming him, naming him FF7 Remake. That'd just be stupid. Can I be honest? Out of all the eight characters in this tournament, I hope Cloud wins. I really want to turn him into a raid boss. Really do. I like his amiibo, I like the character, he's got some good stuff. A couple months ago he got some buffs, so I think he could be a pretty fun, uh, fun little character. I don't know. And then plus, wow, do you see you see Zero Suit Samus when she's facing away? I know you've seen it, I was looking at it. I mean, what? Oh my god, they're touching shields! Well that's okay, they, they'd probably make a cute little shield baby. I, come on, come on, look at him, look at him. You can put him, yeah. Oh my god, she's kicking him! Rude! Okay, at least he remembered how to jump back on stage. He's, re he's level one. They're stupid. They don't know nothing. So maybe they shouldn't be making no shield babies. Is that, is that forward smash? Forward smash usually gets the job done. Well, if you were staring at Zero Suit Samus for whatever reason that might have been in the last match, well, here comes Bayonetta. 
Nobody stare. I, I will report you. I promise. But anyway, the matchup, we have Boshi. Because that's, I mean, that's the purple Yoshi. There's no blue Yoshi. Or is that blue? Um, I'm colorblind. Honestly, I'm actually colorblind. I think that's purple. I'm pretty sure it's purple. But if it's not, then he's blue and purple works. And Boshi works as a name. Woohoo! Anyway, I don't know. Yoshi could have a little, got, got some fun ideas for some characters. I mean, Insta Drop comes to mind. Just, uh constantly dropping on your opponent with his jumping and oh all, all those kicking you know you got to get some foot attacks in there obviously maybe some air attacks uh, I don't know there's some good ideas for Yoshi and then Bayonetta on the other hand amiibos do not learn super combos all right they don't learn Bayonetta style combos whoa whoa I was looking at it no I wasn't I was watching the match what are you talking about what are you talking about put your eyes back on on the on the comp what am I looking? Stop it! Back to the action! Come on! But yeah, Bayonetta could be an interesting one, though. Because, uh, again, Amiibos don't learn all the, you know, Bayonetta, Bayonetta 4 levels of combos. So, uh, maybe they could get a little bit going. Maybe maybe there's an item we could play with. Maybe there's, I don't know, a weird setup we could come up with. So, um, we can hope. See, look at that. There, there, ooh! There you go. Maybe, there, little combos. We like that. So maybe give her, ooh, wait, I got, I actually just got an idea. I don't want to spoil it in case she, if she wins, I don't want to tell you what it is. That will be a secret. That'll be a surprise for her raid boss introduction. But she has to win the match. And who knows, Boshi might say, <laughs> no, I'm winning this one. Oh, come on, you're both in striking range. Somebody just hit and attack. Well, there goes my idea for Bayonetta. Thanks, Boshi. Semi-finals. You heard the man, semi-finals. One side of the bracket is all Mario, and the other half is actually still... Well, one half of that is Mario. 75% of the characters remaining are from the Mario universe. Who's rigging this tournament? What the hell is going on? Something, something's fishy. We need, we need, we need the doc to get to, to the bottom of this. Use some science. Figure out what's going on. Or is just the evil... Oh... That's actually the story. Bowser Jr. is behind this whole thing. He's he's the bad guy. It makes sense. He's the one rigging this tournament. Therefore, he wins this, and we're going to get Cloud, because he doesn't want to face another Mario character. I don't know where I'm going with this. It just makes sense. Bowser Jr. and Cloud in the finals. I'm calling it now. Now it's not going to happen. This match started in the daytime, and now look at the background. Now it's nighttime. You guys want to, like, pick up the pace? Like... <laughs> so people oh my god I actually almost made myself yawn for real wow <laughs> no like come on you two the doc, the doc was literally just stretching there like all right we need a timeout we've been doing a lot of damage you guys haven't done crap hurry up come on just somebody just a smash attack come on junior forward smash right now doc forward smash right now somebody somebody Okay, there's a down smash. Oh, the action is picking up. Is Bowser Jr. on the verge of victory? Or is the doc going to be able to heal himself from his own prescribed medicine of winning? What? Oh, he actually got it. Doc forgot how to get back on ledge. All right, semifinal number two. Cloud taking on the only named amiibo in this whole tournament. I mean, Charizard was named, but that wouldn't be his actual name, you know? Anyway, if Yoshi were to be turned into a raid boss, he's going to become Boshi. That would be his name. That's what he's sticking with. So, maybe being nicknamed has an advantage? But then again, Charizard technically had the nickname of Charizard. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. I don't know. That was my Charizard, my actual Charizard amiibo. That wasn't the Pokemon trainer amiibo. I don't know why I'm telling you this. Nobody cares. Oh no, Cloud is smoking. Boshi's got him on the verge. Oh, he's got limit break ready. One, one attack. Just don't use it on your jump when... Uh oh, he's going to use it on the jump, isn't he? He's going to use it on the jump and he still failed. And he still failed. Wow. Final. You heard the man again. Final match. We got Junior taking on Boshi. And again, maybe we turn... Uh, yeah, let's hit that button. Maybe we, maybe it's not Bowser Jr. Maybe we go with one of the Koopalings if he ends up winning. What if, what if we do like Lemmy or Wendy or Roy or 
whoever else is out there, I forget. I haven't looked at him in a while. So, winner becomes a future raid boss. Oh, Yoshi, big headbutt. We're commentating this whole thing. Mm, probably not, because there's going to be a lot of a lot of down spots. A lot of times where they just don't do nothing. Oh, parry into nothing. What a follow-up. Wow, that's intense. Whoa, look at that. Big moves, big plays by big big characters. Actually, they're not really that big. Did Yoshi just catch the Mecha Koopa, throw it back and miss? I still liked it. I still liked it. It's getting a tiny bit, tiny bit aggressive. But we need that one attack from Yoshi. Could end it. Bowser Jr., just a couple attacks. He could end it. Back throw? Nope, did a forward throw. Why back throw when you're on the, ledge of the edge of the stage? When you could just forward throw and keep your opponent in play. I like these ideas. Bowser Jr. getting a little crazy with it. Come on. Come on. Show it. Oh, he just said fork you. Yes, fork you to Yoshi. You seen him. He brought out his trusty old fork. Somebody, somebody's got to do something. Somebody's going to earn their spot as a future raid boss. It's going to be good. Yoshi with the little tail swipe. Yoshi again. Or is that a kick? I don't even know Yoshi's moveset. I'd have to learn a lot about Yoshi to turn him into a raid boss. But I know I know a little bit. I got some ideas. I got some ideas. But we can do this. <gasps> there's a there's a little... What was that? Like a little cannon? That wasn't the cannonball. That was, that was a something. That was a something. That's the official name of that move. The something. What about that for a name for a raid boss? Just call him something. Mecha Koopa? Explosion? What a follow-up by Bowser Jr. by sitting there and doing absolutely nothing. Yoshi's just going to keep trying to... Ra uh oh Final smash meter. First time it's been on. He's got to activate it. He activates it. Could this be it? Are we about to see the winner? And the obviously the one who wins. And he does it. Ends up turning him into a bunch of just paint. Wow. Didn't see that one coming. There you have it. Junior ends up getting the victory. So that means future raid boss for Bowser Jr. I like it. I got some ideas I got to play around with during training, but... Uh, Ta-da! He wins it. Great boss coming up. So, yep, that's going to be it for this little video. I hope you guys enjoyed mixing it up just a little bit, giving you guys an amiibo tournament, so to speak. So, uh, yep, I believe the next video I should put out will be me training this Bowser Jr. into a raid boss. And until then, I guess I'll see you when I'm looking at you.